to do an update on Star, who has finally been here long enough that I think I can say what she's going to need to succeed. Um, this is a, uh, you know, a, a behaviorally challenged gal who is incredibly suspicious of people. She has uh, been here probably a month. Um, in her first foster situation where she had to be handled for worming and for, you know, her spay and she had to see the vet and all those things, she was quite aggressive. So we brought her here and I've just left her in this um, small room area where she's been perfectly content um, for about a month and I've just been talking to her interacting with her, making eye contact, um, but not not handling her at all. And that's actually worked very, very well. Um, and I do think that we can determine what she does need is a home that she can go into. She seems fine with other cats, so that's the good news. Um, a home she can go into where someone is just going to keep hands off and I suspect this gal is very much like a cat we ended up keeping um, for very similar circumstances showing initial aggression etc. She's just going to take months to come around to de develop a trust. Um, she's not outwardly aggressive, she is defensively aggressive so if you try to touch her, pick her up, handle her you know, that's not good, but she, look, she's making great eye contact. She does slow eye blinks. She's very well behaved in the litter box, her eating habits, her scratching habits. Um, she's afraid of toys. Um, she's actually a very easy keeper, but she needs to go to a home where she can just chill for about six months and develop a relationship on her terms without being pushed at all. And if we can find someone to do that, all fees are waived, you know, we'll work with you. I'd really like to see this gal have a chance. The alternative, honestly, is an animal sanctuary, which really is not the most ideal for a cat like this. Um, and so if someone is out there that has other cats that would be accepting of another cat, they've got a big enough room uh, or house where she could just exist on her own terms, in her own space. She doesn't need a lot of space. She's been in a very small uh, room here for a month and she's been perfectly fine. This is a cat that smaller spaces are fine. But I don't want her going into a home with lots of other cats um, and it's, a, it's crowded already. She does need, you know, an area to herself where she can chill. Someone could give her the time. I think she might end up being actually quite rewarding for somebody. Um, to have really, you know, helped this cat learn to trust and learn to be normal again. So I'm hoping, I'm hoping there's someone out there for Miss Star. Because she is just, just a, you know, just an, a, a cat that wants to be a good girl, but really it has a lot of baggage with her. Star, is a good girl. You want to be a good girl, don't you? Star. Yeah. 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 That's good.